Hey, what's going on YouTube? Back with a quick video here for you today. We're going to go over this uh, Las Vegas shooting again. We have a new theory from a few people online talking about helicopters. And um, this is a very plausible theory. Uh, I have gone over some footage. I have found some things, um, seen some things that people have already mentioned. And I also have, I haven't seen every single video out there. So if somebody has brought this to the attention already, go ahead, flag me, let me know. Uh, we can have a discussion about it. Which I think is very interesting to begin with is this whole video that this man is recording from his cell phone. He's just kind of here at the concert here, and he starts filming basically before the event starts to happen, the shooting. And he's just kind of casually standing here by himself, not really talking to anybody, um... Not really uh, interacting too much. Doesn't he really seem like he's really filming the stage or what's even going on? Just kind of standing in the back here um, towards the exit. And he's basically facing the uh, right where the shooting is going to take place. But now what I want you to do this time when you go through this video here, I want you to, to, to listen. I want you to listen to the sounds of a helicopter. You can definitely hear it in the background. You can definitely hear it coming and going, and you can definitely hear it interjecting with, with, the, with the gunshots. Now, a lot of people think that they've seen gun, the first gunshots over here, in this area right here. And you will see flashes about at the 311 mark right in there. But what I want people to pay attention to is there is going to be a helicopter or a flying object that comes through here with its lights on and it's going to take this path right here I'm not sure what this is off subject real quick what these are either if anybody could tell me what these pillar looking things are so let's pay attention here and we're going to watch this flying object come into the left hand of the screen here and it's going to go all the way behind the Mandolin Bay Hotel and go in between both of the hotels there and then that's when you start seeing the flashing take place over here. And as soon as the flying object gets behind this building right here, gets behind this building right here, the flying object just disappears. They either turn their lights off or they go straight behind the, the, the building and change their, their flight path, which does not make sense to me. So they've either turned their lights off or they're staying behind this building here. And I'm not sure if that's what this guy is filming. Because right now he's just kind of panning around like he's looking for something to start. Now you can hear the helicopter, you hear it? It's in the background. Hear it? You notice right here, you see this light here? And this guy's showing that. And then as soon as that came, let's go back real quick. We'll play it back here in a second. But as soon as this came, I don't know if this is a plane or if this is a helicopter, but as soon as this came in, he flashed those devil signs that over in the left hand corner that's on the back of the trailer. Now let's watch as he comes around the Mandolin Bay here. You hear it? You can hear it right now. There, look right in between the hotels there. You can see that flashing light. Now you hear the first shot. He looks over that way. Now you see right here is where people are talking about the flashes that are coming from out of the hotel. But I actually think that it is this flying object. It's the tail end of the lights. Or maybe it's, maybe it's a combination of both. But there's definitely a flying object there. And that's almost like the tail end. So to me, that could be a helicopter on the tail end. Or some kind of a flying object. A drone or anything. But it seems pretty big for a drone. But I'm not real sure how big government 
military drones are to begin with. So let's go ahead and keep playing this video. Now you're going to notice as soon as this flying object stops blinking and it goes behind this building here, this hotel, you're going to notice that it disappears and we never see the lights flashing again. And that's about simultaneously when the shooting starts to begin. No more flashes are over, you see? You can hear it. You hear it? You hear that? Now we show the devil signs. You hear it? There's no there's no light over there anymore. It's gone. Now these people are leaving. I'm not sure why these people are leaving early. You can hear it. There's no lights in the sky anymore. Now, I think this is weird. This guy is completely calm. He's just walking around recording. It's almost like he's almost anticipated this. And then he's telling these people to stay down, get down. It's almost like it's like a, a natural thing for him to do. You know what I'm saying? Like he's maybe he's law enforcement or works for some kind for a military or uh, army or something of that nature. But the way that he's acting in this situation is completely calm. And he's actually taking charge in the situation where he's telling people to, to sit down, be calm and whatnot. And if you pay attention to these people right here, they are actually laughing, smiling, having a good time, which I thought was kind of weird. I'm not really sure why these people would just stop behind this anyways and instead of to keep going. I don't know if this is just like a photo op or if it's just kind of something to, to, to brainwash the masses to keep the story going. Let's keep, let's keep going here. Everybody stay down. See, he keeps telling them to stay down. Everybody stay down. Like, who is this guy? She's laughing and smiling there. You see her? I mean, security, I mean, they're not even trying to figure out what's going on or anything. Go, 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 go. So you hear shots there. And you hear the helicopter. You hear that? And you hear the shots again when the, hel when the helicopter comes, sound comes back. That doesn't make any sense. That does not make any sense to me. You hear the helicopter. Nobody mentions this. Nobody mentions this. The police, the reporters, the witnesses, because they have been distracted to think the shots have been coming from Mandolin Bay. What if they were coming from the helicopters? You hear them again? The sound is closer. The sound is closer from the gunshots, but so is the helicopter. This is bizarre, people. This needs to be looked into. You hear it. You hear the helicopters coming. What is this guy filming? What is he looking for? Is he trying to show us the helicopters? Hey, where are you? Where are you guys at? Where are you at? See, I don't know if he's on another cell phone right now oh, or if he's or if he has here. two okay. cell phones right or, or what it is, but he's recording from his phone. I don't know if he has another okay. camera or not, but he's recording right from now. his phone, but he's talking at the phone at the same time. I, I, I don't know. I thought that was kind of I thought that was kind of interesting. You hear the helicopter. Light flashing up in there and in between the hotel again. See? Very, very strange. Then you hear the shots again. 
See, this is guy. Go, 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 go. He's taking charge of the whole thing while being patient. We have, a, we have a helicopter on top of Mandolin Bay right now. You see that? Right there. Do you see it? Do you see? Is this a helicopter? Is this a drone? What is this? To me, it's the same thing that we saw before the shooting start. And, it, and it's just kind of circling around here. Now, this would make sense while other places were, sh were shot out, like windows were shot out far away and distances and stuff. Now, this would make sense for that to happen because you could possibly do that from a helicopter, from, from those heights. Look, it's right up there. You see it up top and top screen? It's like, it's like, and he's almost following it, but not. You guys okay? And then when you hear the shots coming back, when the helicopter gets closer, do you hear that? You hear it. This almost seems like it's not a cell phone, the way that it's painting. Seems like a handheld video camera to me. Most people don't hold their phone horizontal either when they film. I don't know why, but... And you know, he just walks around filming what's going on. We got the American Red Cross sign already. Said they were shooting from the top of the hotel. See, he's giving he's giving people the story right now. They're shooting from the top of the hotel. See, people already have this dialogue, so they aren't looking for helicopters. They aren't looking for anything. Helicopter comes back, he starts shooting again. You hear it? This is undeniable evidence, and this needs to be looked into. What else that I thought was interesting is they actually shut down the runways while the shooting was still taking place. In the middle of the shooting, they shut down the runways. I don't know if that's to clear the airways from the flying objects or what's going on or if that was just to so they could get emergency flights in the air, whatever it may be, but some of this, some of this just not add up. People are just walking around. Nobody really seems to be too chaotic. This guy has not let anybody know what's going on. Nobody's letting anybody know what's going on as far as I know. I don't know if that's from him walking or if that's like you hear it now you can hear the helicopter now see this time they can start having some emergency stuff in the sky SWAT teams and stuff looking for people we have the semi trucks here I don't know if that's for the military but with their black semi trucks okay they have the US Army on the side could be just a, a setup you know to, to to show stuff but it means that military presence is there, is, is what it means. You hear the helicopter flying around. Okay, we're going to go ahead and we're going to move a little further ahead in the video. Okay, I went and fast forwarded the video a little bit. I want to show you something else that I thought was interesting. You hear the shots? And you can hear the helicopter too. You see, he just said that's close. Okay. Now, what do we have here? That's what that that's a coincidence again. Okay. Pay attention. You heard those shots. He said it was close. Here, take it. Okay. We hear the. Sh okay, let's go back a little bit. Let's go ahead and and, and rewind here. A little bit. Now let's pay attention. We're gonna hear fire. We're gonna hear gunshots here. Hear him? Let's go back one more time. We're gonna hear gunshots. Here, 
Take it. Okay. And what do we have? We had the flying object in the sky once again. It's the same light pattern. It's the same thing. The same sound. And once it became visible again, the sh the, the the shot started again. And this guy has this. He's pretty much had follow has followed this thing around. It's kind of kind of interesting. See it up there. And once it goes behind the building, it stops. And we have another one over here. You know, like at this point, it could be other other things going on, because I've seen red lights on those two flying objects, but this one's doing the same flight pattern as before. Okay. So that's my opinion on the video here so far. I think we do have. You can see you see different lights on that one flying up there, but I think we do have a maybe some. Um. Shooters and helicopters, some bullets coming from the sky. We did have a eyewitness on, I think it was either CNN or CBS, who gave an eye sta a eyewitness statement saying that he looked up to the sky because he thought bullets were coming from the sky, from heaven, is basically uh, is what he said. So go ahead, comment on the video, uh, like, subscribe, and share. Uh, go ahead and please uh, leave a message below. We can have a discussion. I would like your opinions on this. I think this is important to get out there. And everybody have a blessed, blessed day. Don't forget to subscribe to the social experience.